Hey everybody, what's going on? Your host, Lovely Cheese Pizza here, and my lovely daughter Haley, as I'm back to torture her some more because she enjoys it. And uh, we're going to play some more Home Sweet Home because we've been having a lot of fun with this over the last couple episodes. The the intensity meter dialed up from zero to about 7,000 and really enjoying it. And it went from being a pretty standard horror game with some cool elements to like some weird Attack on Titan fleshy giant monster bullshit. And I'm on board for all of that because it's a <laughs> it really had the adrenaline pumping. And now we're here in a police station. We got to see a demon take a shit and he didn't wipe and then he disappeared and he's leaving that for someone else to deal with and that's just that's just not cool. So now we gotta try to figure out what's up with all of that. And I don't know what that door stands for. And copy machines. Great. More copy machines. Why are there so many copy machines in this place? <laughs> Which which, by the way, I never finished the story that I was trying to, to get to before the Attack on Titan demon showed up. And so, um, with that, so the guy had the full-bodied apparition behind him that he didn't see right away. And then, as he left the room, he could hear from the room he was just in, this girl just yell, GET OUT! Because he started to go back towards the door. And it was really kind of jarring because it was so crystal clear. You just don't really... You know, when you see videos like that, you're, it's always like a very light, you know, like a whispering kind of noise. But this one was like a straight up yell. And so just kind of you're like, whoa, this is kind of exciting. And uh, <laughs> but at the same time, it just like he didn't know any of that stuff until he went back and reviewed it all <laughs> as far as the video goes. And it's just like, you know, there's a girl in here. And she just what needs to use the copy machine. I got to copy my resume. Get the fuck out of here! I don't want you to see that I haven't had a job in 12 years! <laughs> Alright, where are we at? Captain uh, Bunch of Soup was on his desk, or whatever. I don't know how to... Alright. We got a safe. Maybe there's a gun in it. Or some grenade rounds if it's Resident Evil. But where are we going to find... Okay. So obviously... Oh, yeah, okay, what do we... Oh. What's this? A hint of something. Who puts the... P why would you put the passcode for a safe under the desk that it's next to? Because they're stupid. That's <laughs> that's horribly stupid. All right. Well, I mean, okay. So eight six nine. That seems way too easy. All right. So rotate. All right. Well, let's just try it. I mean, eight. Oh, whoops. My bad. Okay. Eight six. Nine. Okay, so it's not that. Okay. So. 60, Okay. I can see this arrow down here. Maybe it's read it upside down. So would it be 60, 90, 80? Let's try that. 60, 80, 90. Okay, it's not that either. Uh, okay, let's try 80, 90, 60 then. Reading it in normal way. 80, 90, 60. Okay. Let's try... Um, 9... Okay, let's try 90... Well, now we already did that. Okay, what, what does this mean? Okay, that arrow means something. Oh, okay, hold on. This may not work, but it said it shows like the arrow, so maybe they mean the opposite side of what these numbers are is actually what it is. So it would be instead of 80, it would be what's on the other side of that. What's on the other side of 80? Okay, so it would be 80. 80, 60, 90. Let's, okay, let's try that. Um, so let's get up. 80, 60, 80, 60, okay, so we have... So, 80. So on the other side of 80 would be 30. So let's try that. And then 60. So let's find 60. So the other side of 60 is 10. 
and then 90 is 40. Let's try that. No? Okay. Um, maybe if we try it backwards, so 60, 90, 80. So let's try that. We got 60, so 10, and then 90 is what, 40? So let's do 40. So 10, 40, and then 80, the other side of 80 is 30. No? Okay. Count from zero going back. That seems strange. 60, 90, 80. Hmm. So 80, 90, 60. Did we, tr did we try that yet? 80, 60, 90? I don't know if we did. So 30, and 40. Damn it. Okay. So 30. No, damn it. I'm getting a little too quick with the trigger here. And then 90, and then 60 is 10. There we go. Okay, sweet. We have a key. Oh, okay, that's the third floor key. So that's that's the key for the, the door that we heard quote-unquote Jane's voice from. I'm not sold for one-third of one second that that was actually her. One-third of one third. So I, I've got a pretty strong so feeling that's, that kind of it is something. definitely something else that is there. Okay, I'll deal with them in a minute. Of course Harrison's still awake. I knew it. I knew he would be. What is this? Special Edition Preta Insight. A Preta is a type of ghost widely known throughout Buddhism, Hinduism, and related religions. It is said to be a ghost that suffers with eternal hunger and thirst. There is a belief that those who committed deadly sins such as thievery while living will be reborn as a Preta. Uh, Thai people also believe that harming your parents will result in direct rebirth as a Preta. The Preta is usually depicted as a tall creature, as tall as a palm tree, a hand as big as a fan palm leaf, uh, and a mouth as small as a pinhole. It will live its life suffering with all the sins it has done. So that's what that freaking thing is. So somebody went and did some shit, and now they're terrorizing people that had nothing to do with it. Whoa! Yep! There he is! <laughs> God! Yep, terrorism terrorism confirmed. Okay, so we're definitely not going back that way, which explains the stairwell over here. Okay, well, or, hold on a minute, can we go back that way? Um, I think I accidentally turned my flashlight off in my own... Yes? I will deal with them in a minute. Okay. Uh, why don't you just go hang with him for a few? Because he, he needs to stay in bed. All righty. All right, what do we got here? What is it? a screwdriver? To, to, uh, to tighten or loosen screws. Oh, so we could probably use that to get... Um, to get back okay so we got to go loosen all the screws on the grate hopefully we can actually get there because I got a feeling these windows seem a little too vulnerable okay here we go yes <laughs> I don't know who's controlling the screwdriver right now that's <laughs> I mean, that's actually kind of creepy in and of itself. <laughs> Nothing like the usage of a phantom screwdriver. That was actually kind of eerie to watch. You would think in a game that, that tries to be relatively realistic with, like, the actual hand over here that he would have used his other actual hand to use the freaking screwdriver. I heard something sliding around. What was it? I heard something. I know I didn't 
pretend hearing that. Oh, no, you don't. You're not pulling a fast one on me. Oh, you're not pulling a fast one on me. They're going to pull a fast one on me, aren't they? Oh, okay. I apologize. It seems like every once in a while this get it's, it's getting a little glitchy. Is that Jane? Jane! That's not Jane. There's Jane! No, there's no way that's Jane. I don't I don't believe it. Okay, it really needs to stop being so jumpy and choppy. What is this? Jane's diary. Oh boy. Okay, maybe it is Jane. It seems, I just, I don't know. I mean, we'll figure it out. Every time I lay down, I, f I found myself in that strange place over and over again. I figured that the sleeping pills might be able to help me through the night and stop me from having this creepy nightmare. There must be rats inside that stair cupboard. Was that where the noise came from? If you keep this up, you'll end up in a mousetrap. I swear. Okay. Um, there we go. Hmm. Command and Control Operation Center. Well, I know that whoever is in control right now definitely is not me. That is for certain. It's the motorcycle gang there. All right, where are you at, Jane? Where could she possibly be right now? From Probably behind that door. If you have seen anyone suspicious, the line will be available 24 hours a day. This is Sisu Pungsuat reporting. Okay. Is he asleep? No. Okay. Um, I went upstairs and got a screwdriver and went and opened the grate to get back behind where it got blocked off. Cool. And then I came upstairs and there was a, a person dressed in white back here walking by that supposedly was Jane. What? Um, and this giant thing is blocking this door, which I'm going to assume is the door that she went into and I can't do anything about it. Cool. So I'm going to assume that we need to go up these stairs, and I'm not going to be happy about it at all, I'm sure. At least you're using that scary walking girl. Uh, yeah, I... The fact that we haven't seen her in a while is actually making me really uncomfortable, because I know at some point she's going to show up, and I'm not going to enjoy it. Because it's going to be probably at... quite possibly the worst time that it could be. All right, what's back in this little? What's in this little sub room here? I'm to know. Mm, nothing. Cool. Nothing out there either. Okay, just an unfinished room. It is way too quiet in this building. My question is, where... We're right back here again. What the hell? Okay, so... Nothing... We just went in a giant circle. That was weird. Okay, so there's got to be something that we missed here. So we really need to... We need to get this thing moving. I just don't know how to do that, and I'm trying to interact with it. Maybe 
what what do you want me to do here? I'm I'm not clear on this. Okay. Um Hmm. There's I mean there's literally nothing to use here. I There's nothing here either. So, okay, the only thing I can think of is, okay, we went upstairs. Oh, okay, we missed that. All right. I did I just I didn't uh I didn't explore that side. Okay, perfect. I was going to say maybe they wanted us to like loop all the way back or something, but that makes a lot more sense. Okay, yeah, and then we need to <laughs> I'm not going to like this either. They're going to send us up and down these stairs, which means at some point when we go either up or down it, something's going to happen. Yeah, here we go. Now it's linked up. We're going to go back up there and somebody's going to be just chilling. Or somebody's going to come just barreling out of that door. Uh-huh. Yep, I can hear the sounds. I can hear it. <laughs> I'm watching for that door. I just I know somebody's going to come out of it. <laughs> uh. All right, let's go. All right, Jane, is that you? Are you hanging out back here? It just crushes me. Okay, I don't see her anywhere. <gasps> oh no! Okay, that's actually worse. It's the what, what? What the hell was that thing called? A Preta? Yeah, yeah, that ain't good. Nice plug, guys. I got the Yggdr the Yggdrasil Group logo on this dilapidated box there. Nice product placement. Oh boy, it's the developer's logo. Okay. Um, I don't really know how to go about this one. Oh boy. It might be. Dude. Oh, please. <laughs> I get so on edge with this damn thing. I'm going. Nope, 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 nope. I'm down. I'm down. I'm down. I'm down. You can't see me. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Well, sure. Didn't realize you could reach around things now. Yeah, that's nice. That's really fair. You're changing your own damn rules. I probably shouldn't have gotten up and ran, really, realistically. I didn't know where else to hide. It wasn't as clear-cut as the other ones. Well, crap. Okay. My question is, how much of this do you have to renew? Probably not much. It's probably a checkpoint right inside of the door that we just opened. Yep. Good call. If there wasn't, uh, we'd be at it for a little while. Yep, I'm just gonna stay right here. I'm not I'm not I'm not gonna be too hasty here. Haste makes waste. Dude, the thing like it looks like a cross between like it almost looks like a terminator. Like obviously we we've learned the lore here, but it the thing legit looks like the thing legit looks like a terminator. Maybe it's just because of the giant red eye thing. It just, it reminds me of, like, it reminds me of the one when they do, like, the, you know, the prologues of Terminator movies, and they've got the, you know, the naked T-600s or whatever running around. Like, that's what that reminds me of. Okay, can we go into any of these doors? No, but we can probably go into that one if we can make it over there. I'm going, I'm going. Yeah, yeah, whoa! Holy smokes. Wow. So he really can reach around things now. I just want to get in this door. Yeah, go back the other way, dude. Again, I, I really do apologize for all the areas where it gets really gritty and like the game kind of glitches out. It just seems like my computer's kind of having a rough time with it for some reason. That in OBS is uh, quite heavy on resources, so. 
It'll be okay. Please don't come to this side. I'm really not equipped to handle that right now. Get down. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why. When you said that, I just heard like Arnold Schwarzenegger do it. Get down. Seriously. Not saying that you sound like Arnold Schwarzenegger because you very clearly Seriously. do not. Okay, he's over there. I'm going in here. I take offense to that. Oh no. Oh no. We're going into a different zone altogether here. Yeah, I'm not ready. Oh, okay. Whoa! How did you get over here? Ah, oh, dude. You and your fleshy unmentionables. Oh. Hi. Hi. Why are you just sitting up there? Are you going to tell me a tale from the crypt or what? Because you really look like the dude from Tales from the Crypt. I don't like that. Why is he swinging his feet? God, that's not cool. That's so that's so menacing. Go back. It actually really did kind of look like Jane. How do you know what Jane looks like? Because we've seen pictures. Jane's Diary, maybe? No. Preda Insight. More, okay. A preda is a lost soul trapped in the eternal torture from its sin. The agonizing hunger and thirst cause it to mourn painfully and creepily all night long. A food offering is the only way to calm the wandering preda. Set up an offering on the table with colorful tablecloth and one lit scented incense. So put food on the tableware, put a scented stick on one of the tableware, and then light it. Okay. So we can make him go away forever if we just give him some damn food? But what kind of food? Does the food consist of humans? Jane? What are you doing? Why are you just sitting there? Where are we supposed to go in this? Jane? Tim! No! Don't follow me! Jane, it's me! Keep away from me! Ah! Oh! Please tell me that's just one and not a second. Oh my god. Oh, what's up with its stomach? Are those a bunch of eyeballs or like boils? Either answer, it, either answer is disgusting. Okay, find a way to calm the preta. We need to get food. What is this? That's the incense. Or no, that's the matches. We need incense. How in God's name am I supposed to do this right now? How am I supposed to do this without him seeing me? There's not really anything to hide behind. Okay, he's looking over there actually. Here we go, here we go. Oh this is oh this is the full the full Monty right here. Okay, so we need to find food. Oh god. Where's the food? Oh, yeah. Smooth move, Adam. Smooth move. Okay. Yeah, don't turn on the flashlight. I just I I really I just wanna I just wanna help you out. That's all I want to do. I don't want to become your dinner. I don't want you to smash my innards. I just want to help you out. That is all. That is all. Please don't kill me. Okay, steamed dumpling. Delicious. Don't worry, dude. I'm, I'm help. I'm ah! I was just trying to help. I got the dumplings. I got the dumplings. And I had matches. All I needed was incense. You would have been fine. God, it's getting hangry over there. Jeez. Just sit down and shove off for a minute. God, why do you gotta be so abusive? I'm just trying to give you some freaking dinner. Lordy. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, man, yeah, it's the full moon. That's really what's causing all this. Okay. All right, so we we read this already. I, I get I get that it's morning, but come on. Jane. Tim. No, don't follow me. Jane, it's me. Keep away from me. Ah! Well, I'm glad you didn't get crushed because that would have been very, very uh, upsetting. Obviously because, you know, she's important, but at the same time, it's like, oh, we did all this traveling through multiple dimensions of hell 
only to watch her get killed by a giant, hungry, one-eyed monster. Lovely. Okay, so now we know where the dumpling is. This helps. Let's just move very quietly. No running. Yep, no standing. Well, I mean, I have to stand to get the dumpling, but... No, no flashlight either. That's the other, the other kicker. Okay. Now we need incense. So let's go find that wherever it may be. Don't worry about me. I'm just trying to help. Is the incense down here? I think it is. That's a cupboard key. Okay. Oh. No, 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 don't. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Oh, no. Don't kill me. I've almost got your dinner, okay? Just calm down. Oh, God. Oh, God! Oh, boy. That is a big, big... I mean, it's not a person anymore. It was. A big former person. Okay, cupboard key. Um, wrong key. Really? So I have the cupboard key for what? For some dilapidated magazines? A piece of mysterious photograph? What, it's a person's shoulder? Okay, this is the third piece of the, of the photo. I'm assuming there's four pieces. But seriously, you're just gonna give me the shoulder? Okay. We gotta make it to the other side. Okay. Gotta take it slowly here. Okay, you're, you're scanning that side. I'm just gonna hide right here. Just gotta get right over there. That's all I gotta do. That's, that's where the other cupboard key is. Don't. 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 You know, just go look somewhere else. Like, look. Ah! <laughs> oh, God. Okay, okay, yep. Alright. Just. It's right over there. Like, how do I make. I, I wish I could. I wish I could make, like, a distraction or something. You know? That would get it to turn and look a different direction. Instead of just being dialed in right on my position. I can't get around it any other way. Ah! Uh, no! Down. Down. Okay. Wrong button. Okay. I gotta... I gotta... Well, I, got, I gotta survey the area a little bit here. I, I gotta try to figure out some sort of thing I can do. Oh, boy. You were just clawing away at this, aren't you? Boy. What an awful position to be in. Just constantly scanning over this one area. Okay, okay. You, you look over there. I'm going... Oh, ah, ah. I was there! I was there, man. I was there. I literally... Uh, okay, so... Now, but that's something that's important to know. Because that means that when we go down to get that key, we can't stay there and use it for cover. And I'm, I think that I'm going to, I'm going to go for that one first, actually. This is quite the game of cat and mouse. Okay. You have to do, do this part again? Yeah. Alright. Gotta go through this whole thing again. Jane? Tim! <laughs> Tim, why do we keep meeting oh, like this? Oh, Jane, it's me! It's away from me! Ah! Okay. Third time's the charm. We will calm, calm you down if it's the last thing I do. Scanning here. 
This may... I'm gonna say, yep, this may go really poorly. Okay. Alright, so we can't go for that first. Okay, so, yep, we have to go for that part last. <sighs> I'm just trying to figure out how we're going to pull that off because there's such a small window of time from when you go to get that thing that you just have to, like, get up and run from there. I mean, it's, it's almost like you have no other choice. And just hope that you can book it into the back room and not get impaled by the long finger of the death law. Okay. Yeah, third time was uh, the furthest thing from being a charm at all. Jane, it's me! You could really use some skin cream. Some Neutrogena would be quite beneficial for you. Because that skin really looks like it's in trouble. Okay. I mean, yeah. What, whatever semblance of quote unquote skin that could possibly be at this juncture. Um, what the hell? Tried to scoop me from right there? Really? You've got to be kidding me. Get under the table. Okay, you know, you can leave me alone whenever you want. I don't know. Okay, so we have this cupboard key. Albeit it's the wrong one. Okay. We're gonna have to... F we're gonna have to figure out a way to make this work. Okay. This is definitely a better vantage point than where we were at before, I feel like. It doesn't matter. I mean... At, the, at this juncture, I have an idea. Oh, I have an idea. Okay. We need to get under that table that's right next to the... If we can get under the table that's right next to that little area, I think we're going to be okay. We just have to get there first. Because un the, getting under these tables, it's a fully protected area. Okay, yep, you... Pan over it. Pan over it. No, no, no. Hand over it. Go the look the other way, please. Okay. Really feeling good about this one. If I can just, if you can look th over here. Okay. I'm gonna go for it. Oh, wait a minute! It pulled the table away. The tables are gone. Crap, I can't use that to my advantage now. Oh, that sucks. That is... That sucks. So I I really had to... Oh, no. I don't think we're going to be able to get this done. I'm, I am almost certain we're going to die. I think we're just going to have to make a run for it. I don't know how we're going to do this. <laughs> oh, no. Well, not slow enough, unfortunately. Well, yeah. Tim is by no means a gifted athlete. Oh, God. I'm going. Oh, no. Man, this is so hard. Okay, so we just we have to make a break for it and get under that table before he pulls it up. Oh, this is this is tough. Okay. So stealth and being ballsy are you gotta have the right you gotta have the right mix. Because I was a little bit too conservative for my own good, and it definitely came back to get me. Oh. 
Jane? Tim! No! Don't follow me! Jane, it's me! Keep away from me! Ah! Alright. We got it this time. I can I can feel it in my bones. Got a good feeling. Just gotta Nice and easy. Nothing too sudden. Let's just get all the main things that we've got to have first. Let's go get the dumpling. Got that. Let's just be nice and careful. Let's get underneath this table. You can totally look somewhere else. Thank you. We're going to get our first cupboard key. starting to pull these tables away. Alright. Now. Good to go. And then, don't you dare take this one away. I need this one. I need this one. No! Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yes. Yes! There we go. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Nope, we're fine. Yeah, you're not taking it from me this time, you sack of garbage. Go, go. Go! Oh, yeah. Okay. We got this, and we got this. We got our lovely shoulder picture that is apparently not in here anymore. Because we are... Oh, we already got it, so... And now the incense. Now... We gotta... Oh, no. You're kidding me. Now it's patrolling the area? Oh, dude. Okay. Wait a minute. Oh, it blocked off the... What? It blocked off the door? Then how the hell are we gonna get over there? Um... Oh. What the hell is this? Screwdriver again. We get to do some more phantom screwdriver work? Sign me up. Yep, right here. Check this out. The screwdriver operates on its own. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. We have to get all the way up to that gosh dang altar from here? Are you kidding? Nope. You're not getting me. You can go screw off. All this just because I'm trying to help you. What kind of deranged thing are you? you? Won't even let people help you. There we go. One of the very few tables remaining. <laughs> Please let me get under this one. Oh. Okay. I don't think it can see me this close. Come on. Let's put this together. Please. Yes! Yeah! Not mad at me anymore, are ya? Feast on that dumpling for the first time in 300 years. Let's freaking go. He's like, finally! All I wanted was some dumplings. Cool. I don't think that's going to keep it tied over for very long, though. Now... What have we here? Newspaper dated October 5th, 2002. A legal race ends with a steel bar through an eye. Oh. This could be interesting. At 2 a.m. tonight, Yassathorn Police Force was chasing illegal racers through Yassathorn Highway. The capture took place... Er, the capture took place with some had fled the scene. That doesn't make sense. One of those is Mr. Pishai Manapaiboon, who ended up with a steel bar piercing his left eye through through the skull when crashing into a truck. That's who that is. Oh, my God. All right. Mr. Pishai Orte was the main suspect in many motorcycle theft cases, and the police are gathering all the crucial evidence for further investigation. The body of Mr. Pishai has been sent to his family to proceed with the funeral as should. 
little bit of uh, some translation errors, I suppose. And the reason why he turned into one of these damn things is probably because of all the stuff that, all the sins that he committed oh, she... that hurt his family. Damn, that's crazy. Jane is here. Find her. Well, I will try. It'd be nice if she'd stop running away from me. Even more interesting as to why she's running away from me. What the hell is this? I don't like this little altar thing here. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, that's not good. I see another one of, uh... Jane's Diaries, May 5th. I was up during the night again, not in the bedroom, but in the middle of the house. It seems like I couldn't get a hold of my senses. I couldn't shake off the feeling that I was being watched from outside the house. It felt as if it, as if that thing that it tried to kill me... It, or, hold on, that didn't sound right. It felt as if it was that thing that tried to kill me in that nightmare. Jane, what is it? Why are you like this? Okay. That door's not happening. So, underneath we go. We've become very experienced going underneath tables. Jane? Oh, where are we going now? We're leaving the area again, aren't we? Oh, no. We're going back into the house. Or the tenement building again, possibly. Oh, boy. Why is it so dark? I was going to say, why is it so dark in here? And why is the house so trashed? Home? Again? Jane's still there. I need to get her out. I don't know, man. She might be here. This... I don't like the feel of this house at all right now. But, I think we're going to stop right here. And when we come back on the next installment of Let's Play Home Sweet Home, we're going to investigate our now totally trashed house and try to figure out where Jane is, because he thinks that she's still there, but I think she might be here. Possibly. I don't know. So we'll, uh, we'll figure that out next time. But until then, my friends, thank you for stopping by and watching and enduring the struggle. And uh, next time we'll have some more fun. So until then, this is your host, Lovely Cheese Pizza, and my lovely daughter, Haley, saying thank you guys for watching. And we'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye.